way those. Yeah. You yeah. on. You on. Yes, I am on. So here we go. Let's do this. What's up, everybody? This is Dr. Tango Mike. I got my uh, my hat on to keep my head warm and got my big headphones on so I can hear you. If you want to join us in the Discord, check the link in the description of the video and join us in the Discord. You're also free to share your screen. So, bam, that's the voice of Brie that you heard in the beginning when she said, you're on, bruh. So, <laughs> <laughs> it is 8 o'clock. It's a Monday. And what do we do on Mondays? We try to take over the world one drawing at a time. And that means I'm sketchable. So, we're going to go ahead and break out the sketchable. Tamika is in the house. She says, hey, hey, hey. And, uh, and how appropriate because I am going to use one of the drawings that I drew during her uh figure drawing sessions as the base to my um character that i want to draw i'm going to draw intavius not only that i'm also going to turn it into an nft tonight it's going to happen all together uh excuse me at the same time okay 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 so if you remember thursday's stream uh tamika grooms tamika the artist on behance you will uh, remember that we went through some uh, poses. And so some of these poses are cool. And uh, especially the last pose, because by then you're so far into your zone that you know you draw uh, the character and it looks cool, it looks smooth, it looks right. And so that's what's gonna be. Now I do have to add a couple of things to Intavius. I mean, I could just make him simple. He does have toes and feet. Ah. Uh. I'm going to have to add on to it. So I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Well, let's do it. Let's go with it and see what happens. Um, I may not mint it tonight because I only have one hour. And for those of you who caught my stream earlier today, then you know that I was on um, live on um, Behance, Behance Live official, and uh, had a good time with Claudi, amazing, talented artist super cool all around person and so i have to finish that drawing tonight like because because i need to show up tomorrow with uh, a drawing that only needs a few little tweaks so it's gonna be a long night for me and, and i've already been having some long nights i'm tired i need a nap so it's all good don't complain all right don't complain about it be about it so there we go we got intavius i have him on his own layer there it is i can turn down the layer a little bit and in this case, I'm going to hop right into some, some details. Let's go ahead and see if we can add some gear. Because all of these scullies, what's up, Zachariah? How you doing? All of these, not scullies, all of these sketchies have some type of gear that helps them move about and go through what they need to go through. So there we go. Let's go ahead and get to it. Odari has joined us in the Discord. Word up, word up. Um, uh, Zechariah, Garrett, Tamika, and Otari are hanging out in the Behance chat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice. All right. So let's go ahead and do this, right? Let's get your pencils. Get your pencils and let's go. All right. There we go. There we go. Mm, mm, mm. The easiest thing in the world is the head. So I'm going to make a big head. I'm going to make it like super big. Oh, I know what, what's happening. I, I did switch on my, my blue pencil. There it is. And uh, so I can make some adjustments. Did I start a new layer? I thought I started a new layer. No, it's in the same layer. Look at that. Mm, mm, mm. Getting sidetracked, talking to people. There we go. Get on the job. Get on the job. There we go. Plus new layer. Got it. Bam. Now I can go ahead and uh, work on it. What's up? Golden Rose in the house. The usual suspect says, go to Rosa. <laughs> and listen, I want to thank all of you for showing up this morning to the Behance Live. I want you to do it one more time, please, tomorrow at 12.30 p.m. Eastern. I know it's in the middle of the day, but uh, it's like it just feels so good to hear the comments and the names that Claddy was reading off, you know, um, from the chat, the Behance chat. So if you want to hear your name called, then come on through, leave a comment in the chat. I really enjoy the coo 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 comments, the boom, 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 because that's my thing, right? So there it is. That's what uh, 
um, that kind of brought our own flavor that brought our own identity into, um, into, uh, the stream this morning. Yeah. 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 I, I told Claudia, so those are my folks. I'm talking about my people. So I appreciate that. So there we go. All right. So let's go ahead and, uh, just, I want to add a little bit of extra decals. Uh, Zechariah, you want your name said tomorrow in the live, then please go ahead. Uh, that's right. The people need to see Bat Dan tomorrow. <laughs> I should bring my mask, huh? Bat Dan. So we were talking about, um, wearing masks. So, uh, so yeah. Um, I hope that we can, uh, make this a regular thing because Claudia is super cool and, uh, and she likes to laugh and that's, that's important in a, uh, stream. Bam. There we go. Bam. You got to. You kind of have to, you know, get people into that groove, into your groove. Yes, the mask. Yes. All right. Uh, <laughs> it's behind me. That mask is behind me. I may just bring it. Why not? All right. So Octavius is in the house. And we need to add some gear for Octavius. And let's go like this. So he's going to have like a, a, a bag or something and he's uh he needs some gear so maybe that's what all we're gonna get to do today is give um boom do that uh give octavius his gear so let's see if i can do this right boom bam bam there we go something like that all right cool so there it is you got a messenger bag got it uh, sketching and drawing was rolling in deep. Yes. Never died my loyalty because I put out food to hang with you as long as possible. <laughs> no, well, you can bring your snack, bring a snack. I was over here with, <laughs> well, believe it or not, I have not eaten today. I, uh, I, I think my stomach was not happy with dinner yesterday. So I've been starving just right. Well, I'm not even starving because my stomach hurts. So I did sip on some copy coffee. coffee. And uh, took some, uh, what do you call that? Probiotics. I'll, I'll drink some, um, some sad, sad apple cider vinegar tonight so I can squeeze out whatever is trying to drag me down. And we will see each other tomorrow. Yes. Uh, tomorrow is going to be awesome. We got to show Adobe how we get down over here on the sketching and drawing Discord. So that's super cool. Plus, we do have one Adobe, um, a couple of Adobe artists who are going to be joining us with the Scully. So that's coming out really cool. Have you wheeled your fridge through like Steve? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring it, bring it over. All right. So here we go. Let's go ahead and uh, think about what am I going to put on? Octavia. So I already thickened out the forearm. I think I need that because I want to be able to like to put some things here. So what exactly? I don't know, but you know, I like, um, like, uh, gauntlets or something related to that. And somebody mentioned the, the infinity gauntlet this morning from a sketch that I did. I was just sketching. Um, but so, so, I, so I like to have some kind of strong, um, forearm, something there. So, uh, so then, so that's why I did that. So I can do that here too. Like, let's go ahead and go like this and let's go like that. So maybe make it bigger. All right, let's, uh, start, uh, start that line over. So make it bigger. And this is on the outside of the arm. Boom. This is why you draw your characters and layers. And, uh, and so the very first layer you saw was the scribble. Then the second layer is like, well, what does this character look like? You know, what what are some of the, what is he made out of? How does he, how is he, um, is the body? What is, kind of body is this? And now the next layer is like, well, what kind of stuff does this body have? And so I like all the circles still. I'm still down with the circles. So let's go ahead and go like that. What I like about the circles is that it makes it look like that's where the bendy parts happen. Right? So, so there you go. So then let's go like this. Boom. Uh, and then like that and boom. And so, so now we have a circle here and a circle there and a kind of circle there. So now we kind of see the back of the hand. 
So you got to like play around with it. So now I can fix this um, finger, put a little lump right there, another lump right there. And so then I can do this other like this. So I'll put a lump right there and a lump right there. Boom. So now we got like uh, the other fingers kind of creeping from around the back. Right. Got it. Boom. And then let's go ahead and go there. I don't like that. So let's fix it. And, you know, I don't know what I'm doing with this character. I just drew it. I did uh, think about the, the character when I was uh, doing the figure drawing session with Tamika. And I was like, yeah, what should I draw? What could I do? That's way too fat. It's too big. Um, and so, you know, having drawn these characters before is helpful because then you know, you don't spend a lot of time trying to figure out what to draw. And that should never be a thing, right? You should never have this feeling like, I don't know what to draw. Like, what? What? <sighs> Ask anyone who, you, who knows you draw. They'll give you a ton of ideas. I get that all the time. Friends text me like, you know what would be cool, Dan? And then they give me this whole thing. It's like, yeah, but you're, you're not going to do anything with that artwork. You're just telling me like that's a cool thing to see drawn up. And so, uh, so yeah, it's, uh, it's definitely, there's ton of ideas out there. And so it's, it's, you should, what you should do is have a list, a, to, a, a drawing list and, uh, of something that you can draw at any given time. And even if you've drawn it before, that's one thing my brother likes to say, like you drawing this again. And I was like, yeah, cause that's what I like. So I'm gonna draw what I like. And then, uh, and so now like I have this, um, this uh, ready-made list of things that I know how to draw really good, really fast whenever I, I need to draw something, especially like for the class. And, uh, and so I've done these um, uh, live art events, it's been a while. And, uh, and so it's like you try to find inspiration from what's happening. I, I did live art one time at a wedding. That's crazy. We went to the wedding. We sat there and then went to the reception and uh, it was my time to work. I, I ate some good food, but still I had to stand there and paint and so on. And people were taking pictures of me. And so with something like that, well, we already know what we're going to draw. We're going to draw the couple, you know, draw the, the people, which I still had that painting. Um, we kind of uh, got busy with our lives. And um, and so in every few years, he's like, hey, Dan, I want to get that painting. Like, yeah, you should. And then uh, we ain't got time to get together. Very busy person. In any case, what happens with something like that is that you have a list of ready-made things that you're used to drawing all the time. And so when somebody asks you, hey, Dan, can you draw? Can you do an event? Blah, blah, blah. Like, yeah, yeah. What you got? What's the event about? Oh, do your thing. Uh, there was this one event that I have. Uh, I was working, uh, trying to get locked in, locking it in. So this is the side. There goes the front. That's the side. And, um, it was right be early last year, right? Right before everything went crazy. And, uh, as a matter of fact, um, I ended up doing a different event, uh, that same date. My, uh, my people from, uh, what's that alcohol people? They're down there. I have a whole little statue down there. Let me see. There it is down there. See that guy over there? He's that guy right there standing right there. That's Jack Daniels. Yeah. So my people from Jack Daniels, they hit me. I was like, hey, Dan. So we're going to have uh, um, an event at uh, at uh, uh, Mercedes Benz, um, the Mercedes Benz Stadium. I was like, cool, let's do it. And I had already been talking to these other people about doing their event. But they were a little wishy-washy about the price. So, so I stopped responding. And then they call me um, the week of, or they text me. They call me or text me. He's like, hey, do you have any other people who can come? And I was like, uh, no, we're all going to be at the one event that uh, all, all the artists whom I know, they're coming. And um, and that's because I didn't want to, like, keep playing games with them. But and so I just kind of, you know, said what I said. But what I wanted to draw, it was going to require a little bit of extra cash. And they weren't ready to pay it. And, uh, and what I wanted to draw was some Aztec stuff. I wanted to draw some Aztec. 
artwork. Okay, so I'm looking at this hand. This hand is way too big. So what do you do? You select it. Boom, you go like that and then like that. Bam. Then you select it. And now you look at it it's like, yeah, that's better because it looked kind of long. So let's turn that down some more. Here we go. Yeah, yeah. So now it looks like it is for shortening and far falling farther away. Whereas this hand is uh, should be bigger because it's closer and it's in front of the body. And since I'm going to put that hand right here, let me go ahead and fix it. Boom. And so I have three three uh, knuckles there. So we're going to go with three. We're just going to keep it at three. Boom. Bam. Mm -hmm. And uh, and what I want is a big pencil. And uh, anybody who was around this morning saw that I drew a big pencil. I like big pencils and I cannot lie. There we go. Boom. Let's go like that right there. Uh, yes. All right. There we go. Got it. Good. Bam. So let's go ahead. And uh, and so this hand is going to be far enough in the front to to for this pencil to be far enough in the front of this arm. So here we go. Bam. Bam. Boom, and let's go. Uh, uh. Let's make that happen. Or actually, let's go like this. Then I can go like that. Or actually, let's let's fix it. I don't like straight pencils. I don't like them. Not that I don't like a pencil that's straight. I just don't like drawing them really straight. Like that's that's not a realistic. My all of my pencils are a little chunky and bendy no and you know what i was out hanging out one time in somewhere i think it was la and i came across this store that had uh pencils um that looked like bark they were bark pencils so they had the branch it was a branch looking it was all crooked and weird and inside it had lead so that was awesome big ups to tamika joining us here on the discord if any of you are out drawing you can share what you're drawing it's all good and uh and if you have any questions please drop it in the chat or say it out loud because we will be able to hear you in the stream right now if you say anything out loud all right so here we go bam 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 i like this i'm kind of just uh making adjustments and you know what this reminds me of it reminds me of that movie uh what was the name of that movie? It was Robots, and it was Robin Williams. What movie was he in? Uh, Robin Williams. Was there something Robots? Let me see. Let me just look up Robin Williams, and uh, I can find. the. He's been in a ton of movies, that guy. That guy. Let me see. Uh, where is? Oh, Robots. It was called Robots. <laughs> Yes, and so that movie Robots, let me see if I can find some images. Yeah, so that's what it reminds me of, like uh, very um, metallic uh, shapes. Bicentennial Man, uh, Man, that's the other one, yes, where he was a robot himself. <laughs> uh, Bicentennial Man, he was a robot, but in the movie Robots, there was all robots. Everybody was a robot, so, um, so that's how I feel about this piece. It's like, yeah. And you know, if we're going to do like a, a digital head, because this is a surface head, then we need to make the pencil. And is that on the same layer? I think I've been on the uh, messing around the wrong layers. Let's go like this. Boom, bam. There it is. We're going to make it a bam. There it is. Got it. Uh, uh. A digital pencil. Well, I thought I was I had enough data here in this uh, for this character to turn around and turn it into a uh, what do you call it uh, a uh, NFT, but I don't think so because I'm sitting here thinking of stuff to do, and it's like, dang, that's gonna take some time to even just r render. And, uh, and I don't know if we have enough time for that. Yes, Bicentennial Man. Uh-huh. 
Um, uh, so robots, it was a bunch of robots and it's a city of robots. And I think what was like the main story of that? In any case, uh, who, who, what did he, what did he play? Let me see. Uh, it, come on. In a world of sentient robots, striving young inventor, Rodney Copper Bottom, Edwin McGregor wants to work for the ambicular Big Wheel, Mill Brooks whose Big Wheel Industries make spare robot parts, but Big Wheel had just been deposed as a company head by the vin villain villainous Phineas T. Ratchet, Greg Kinnear, who wants to make all the robots submit to profitable force upgrades. In this animated adventure, Ronnie and his friend Fender, Robin Williams, go underground to fight Ratchet's evil plan. So, uh, Robin Williams was Fender. Hmm. That's cool. Is it the red? Well, it's the red one. The red one. The crazy one. That's right. It was uh, and uh, the red one. Yes. Robin Williams had many sci-fi related movies. Yes. Yes, he did. He was uh, ahead of his time. All right. So there it is. Now, what I want to do is, which is really covering up, is uh, what if I had like a belt? Uh-huh. But you can still do the pouches here. Because, you know, I like pouches. So we need to have pouches. Bam. Yes. Boom. Mm-hmm. Got it. Bam. Bam. Boom. There he goes. Add a pouch. Right there. So he's got pouches. We got pouches. Uh, uh, I do like... Um, or uh, Golden Rose says, uh, switch it to mobile. We'll be listening while I do a little bit of work. Awesome. No worries. No worries. Do your thing. I think I like the way this shape goes like this. And uh, I messed up my line. Mm -hmm. And then this is going to go like that. Uh. And uh, bam. What, speaking of movies, anybody excited for The Matrix? Are there any Matrix people here? Let's do more pouches here. Anybody interested in the Matrix? I remember when the movie came out. And uh, it was a pretty smooth movie. Um, they're going to mess it up, Tamika. Just, just, just get it out there. It's like <laughs> they're messing with your characters because they got a, like a young Morpheus and so on, I think. Um, uh, but let me tell you something. Tamika said, I'm afraid they're going to mess it up. Um, it's going to get messed up. It's just going to happen. That's how it works, right? However, what you want to do when you're looking at that movie is do what I'm going to do. Is uh, I just want to see another um, Trinity and um, um, Keanu adventure. Kind of like, which is terrible. Like um, coming to America, the story was whack. Characters were whack. There was a whole lot of whackness in that movie. But that's not that we weren't. They they weren't aiming for um, another Shakespeare level of a film, like the first movie. That's not what the goal was. The goal was to make something that. Reminded people of the original characters, and you got to see all these folks back on the screen and uh, and laugh at some corny jokes. So, there. That's it. That's all I got to say about that. Terrible, terrible movie. They could have they had a good, a good, uh, a good uh, film there. But it was eye candy for those who missed it. A lot of things wrong with it. But we're not going to talk about that. Gonna, I'm just gonna tell you that it's terrible. Anyways, uh, so yes, expect that the Matrix uh, is going to not align with the level of quality. However, the Wachowski sisters are back on it, so you know, uh, maybe they care. Uh, Garrett says, same with the new Bill and Ted. There was a new Bill and Ted. Uh, there was. That's right. They were old, wasn't it, Bill? Uh, let's see. They have some uh, muscle guy in it. And that guy who plays um, the friend, 
Uh, Bill. Oof. I'm like, brother, you needed some time to, uh, it's called face the music. You need some time to work on your face. Like, I'm not coming out of, out of retirement, acting retirement 20 years later, and uh, you're going to have to do a Kardashian or something. That's what, um, who was that? Smokey and the Bear did. He, he kept getting his face worked on till the day he died. But he looked like, um, like he was still a young person or something. I don't like that. Um, because it, of course, he knew he wasn't young, but he still looked it. And, uh, and so, yeah, that's kind of like uh, what you're going to have to do. When you are, your, your, your face is, is part of the story, you know? Yeah. Anyways, that's why I'm not a, I'm not a, um, a superstar, a movie star. Cause probably I wouldn't do that either. Be like, that's how I look, man. <laughs> We're going to roll with this. All right. So the legs, I'm cool with them ha being a little skinny. However, I think I'm going to add something to the leg, to the thigh. So that it has that gear, you know, got to have some gear. And then there goes that. So, mm, mm. boom, boom. And then, bam. There it is. Boom. All right. Going to be some, some details to go in there. And then the knee, we got the knee. Just to make some circles. All right. And so, yeah, I'm going to add like something here. So let's make that in a new layer so that it's easy to get complicated. And this is what happens with character design is like it starts to look complicated a little bit. Mm. Mm hmm. Bam, bam, boom. Boom. There we go. Mm. Is that it? Is that it? I don't know. Let's go. Let's go. It needs to be up and then down. There it is. That's what we'll do. And then sure, let's go that part. Let's do that part. And then this part goes out like this. Bam. Boom. Boom. And there's the pencil. So he carries a backup pencil. Any artist will have at least two pencils. If you're into art and like drawing, you got to have two pencils. If you didn't have two pencils before, Get you a second pencil. You got to have it. All right. So there's that. So now let's go ahead and see if I can do something here. Mm -hmm. And then this is going to be a different kind of pencil. I like it. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Boom. There it is. Whoop. There it is. Uh-huh. All right. Not like that. Let's fix it. Boom, boom, and then maybe, mm, maybe just go like that, and then not this one. We're not going to have this one. There it is. Boom, boom, boom. Right now, I am drawing with uh, the Surface Pen uh, 2, which uh, is according to the last, latest announcement, there's a new one coming out. This No, this is a Surface Pen Slim, and then there's a 2 coming out. I like it. It's okay. But you, I feel like I don't have enough uh, grip on it, so I put some little grip tape on it. There it is. So then I can um, draw with it. But I feel more relaxed when I use this pencil. All right. Okay, so now this leg is back there. This leg is up here. So let's make that leg strong, straight like this. Just, just, just roll with it. Let's roll with it. Boom, bam, bam, uh-huh, uh-huh. All right, and now I can go ahead and set that up. Mm. And then, so the ball, this is, this is the ankle. I was watching the game the other day, the Raiders game. I guess there's a game tonight. I ain't pay attention to that game. But the Raiders game went into overtime. And people were getting hurt because, you know, you kind of, you train, but you don't, you're not trying to play five quarters. You're trying to play four quarters. So you give it your all. And, uh, and by the time that overtime comes in, 
you know, you you are kind of um, spending everything you got. And uh, and so this is uh, this is where injuries come in because you're going a little further than than what you uh, meant to to uh, be able to accomplish. And so I just say that to say, here's the the ankle. We gotta have those points. All right, there it is. Bam. Okay, so we got something there. I feel like that's too little. It needs to be bigger. And what layer am I on? Oh, okay. Hmm. Make that bigger. All right. How do we do that? How do we do that? Gonna just select. Make a selection. And uh, actually, let's just leave that line and leave that line. Let's see what happens. All right. Here we go. Lock it. Hmm. There it is. Make it really big. Kind of into the leg. There it is. Got it. And so now let's draw it right. Uh huh. So let's go like this. Boom. Mm hmm. Bam. Boom. Got it. Yeah. Yeah. Have it overlap, you know? Uh huh. A little bit of there. So there we go. Uh -huh. And then erase that right there. So what happens when you're sketching and stuff like this, it starts to look a little crowded. There's a lot of things going on and it's real easy to lose yourself. And, uh, and so that's why we use a lot of different layers so that you can, uh, see what you're drawing, like what's happening here. But sometimes I don't use all those layers. Sometimes I just keep going from the same layer, see what happens. And that's what we're doing now. Okay. Okay. So here I can, Start doing some things, right? Mm-hmm. Bam. There we go. Mm-hmm. All right. Just add some little elements. Little elements that, that make it stand out, you know? Bam. There we go. Like this. Uh. Uh. Mm. Mm. Brand new flavor in your ear the brand new flavor in your ear uh uh dun, dun. there it is boom maybe um now one thing i noticed like in um uh what movie was that it was another that's what this movie was done but it's you know they don't take themselves seriously and uh with the rock and statham and like they do so much stuff, it's like a normal person would have died already, but uh, but they don't die, and uh, and so they had Idris Elba, and he had like these guns on his chest, or, or at least one gun in his chest that he can reach over and grab, like that off of his uh, shoulder, and so I like that. I was like, that is a perfect spot for a pencil, so I just don't know how do I go about grabbing it, but you know what I'm gonna do. Nah, forget that. Here's what's happening. There we go. Bam. There it is. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. There it is. Let me see. Let's do that again. Let's do it better. Got a backup, backup. He's got a backup to the backup. Uh huh. Yeah, he's got a backpack, 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 backup. This sounds crazy, I know. It's all good. There it is. Bam. Let's fix that. It could be better, Dan. It could be better. Uh, let's do that one. Bam. Here it is. Boom. There it goes. And let's just like put some circles on it. There it is. Got it. In the house. So there it is. I got my man. Woo, Inktavius. It took me a long time to get here. So let's go ahead and hop on to some inking right away. Just so that we can at least have that halfway done and I come back to it. Because uh, I still got to draw that 
thing from this morning, the, uh, the, the sketchy. I have a sketchy that I drew this morning and, uh, and I gotta get on it. I gotta get like further along than what it is. Cause I only have 90 minutes to finish that. And that's live on behalf. So I really can't mess around. You can't mess around. Let me draw this pencil. Cause maybe I can do it in a different angle. And this is what you do. You know, and then make it thin. You see that? Make it a little thinner. Got it. And because it's in its own layer, huh? How that happened? What's down there? I don't know what's down there, but it's all good. Let me see that. Oh, I know what happened. I know what happened. Did I not make a new layer? I thought I did. I thought I did. I'm getting too excited. All right, hold on, hold on. There we go. You got to have layers. There it is. Bam. Oh, I know what happened because I turned down. I turned off another layer, and I thought I had it done that. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Here we go. Let's do this, yo. All right, let's get that pencil done. Mm-hmm. Boom, boom. It could be a little cricket. Sure, why not? It's seen some battles. Mm-hmm. Bam. So I got a pencil. Boom, here it is. And I can rotate it. Uh-huh, there it goes. Got it. Bam. You got to do things and uh, draw parts, bits and pieces in different layers. There you go. Mm -hmm. Let's do some little designs here. Uh, it's too thick. It's too thick. You know what? I should do those designs later because I need to change the thickness on my, on my uh, brush. So right now, let's go ahead and do this. Mm -hmm. That's a super fat brush stroke, and I'm okay with it. Bam. There it is. Bam. And this is where I will use different layers for different parts that intersect so that I can clean up that lines. I want to clean up the lines. Huh, what happened to my picture up here? There we go. Hmm, who did that? Who did that? All right, got it. Uh, boom. All right. So that's the backpack. And then check it out. When I do the face, new layer. And now I'm going to do the face and uh, grab, bring that line. Bring this line. And then uh, bring, uh, let's see, let's go like that. Boom. Look at that. Mm. Yep. And then, of course, the back. That's that. Uh, is anybody going to buy the new Surface devices? Did y'all see them? Anybody notice them? It was insane. Here we go. They were insane and including uh, what one thing I did like was um the Surface Pro uh Studio. Surface Studio Pro, Surface Studio laptop, something like that. Oh my gosh, it's awesome. Well, I just kind of like the way it works. I ain't never tried it. And now we don't have Microsoft Store, so what are you gonna do about it? There it is, boom. See how I erased those lines that were near the edges and it did not bother my drawing, the other lines that I don't want to mess with. See that, there you go, there it is. Get rid of that, bam, nice. And then I can do another layer for the face put that on a different layer so right now my brush size is what is it it's in the 25 or so let's go with the uh and you got to remember let's go with the 15 somewhere and then i'll do this inside of here mm -hmm. well that's the wrong i thought i was moving this brush okay this is a 50 uh so let's go with 25 nobody told me you guys should have said something so dan you're wrong that's not what's happening right now. There we go. Bam. Mm. There it is. And you see how light I can go. Boom. Let's go ahead and do the nose. Bam. Boom. Okay, got it. 
All right, now that I drew the face, I can move the face. See, maybe I can put it right here a little bit and tilt it. No, 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 I think it was fine. There it is, bam. It's just moving through this drawing is, is amazing. I like how Sketchable has all these different tools uh, for me to go ahead and uh, ink my drawing. So I just, I just put that face and head together. So let's go there, boom, nice, and now I can do the body. All right, Oof. yes, I made it tough on myself. Well, but um, like a friend of mine said, if it was easy, then everybody be doing it. Uh -huh. All right, uh. boom, bam. Okay, let's fix that, let's fix it. You know, uh, and I'm okay if it's not super straight. Like, that's cool, because then it looks like it was hand-drawn, like somebody drew this. And, it, and I did, I did draw it, you know? So that's kind of like the little extras. There you go, boom. Now this one, I do want it to go all the way around. Bam, Woo. oh my gosh. That was a little stressful. Hey, come back, come back, there we go. Baby, come back. All right, come on, there it is. This is that part, so now I can erase that line. There it is. Uh -huh. Boom. There we go. Oh, and I need to fix that anyways because it's got. Oh, not that way. Uh-huh. Bam. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. And then I have to. Mm, but I need to do that in a different layer. Uh-huh. Get it. Get caught up. Okay, that one's good. And now I need a new layer. Sure. Let's use that one. And then I will make this line here. Got it. And now I can erase the parts that are no good. You're no good. You're no good. Baby. Baby, you're no good. Oh, what did I do? Come on. I need to click on that over there. All right. And so now let's see. Yes, this line. And now I can clean that up. Yeah, but they have to be in different layers. Otherwise, um, I'm going to cross, cross contaminate with the brush strokes and there it comes. Wow. There it is. If anybody got some questions about it, please let me know. Drop it in the comments. We are not going to be able to finish this tonight. However, I appreciate all of you stopping by saying hello, dropping comments in the chat, joining us on discord. I will hang out in the discord for a little while. Yeah, let's not do that. So if you have other questions or things you'd like to talk about, let's do it. Let's do it. Like Tone Loke said. I feel like this, this part is too short compared to the other arm, but it's foreshortening. So maybe this part is too long. I'm gonna have to think about that. Uh, I'll come back, I'll come back. Mm. But that's not what I want, right? Let me see. Let me see. Yep, not what I want. Got to do different layers, different layers. All right, so let's go ahead and do this. Hmm. Cricket. Boom. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Got it. So that's cool. I can I can deal with this a little bit right there. Bam. And so now I can do a different layer. So as you can see, I'm hopping around like three different layers. Do it. Do it. Oh. Nope. That was uh, not good. There it is. Got it. And so now let's go ahead and get rid of that right there. Go back to this other layer. And now I can erase this like that. Nice. So now it has this overlapping look. And it looks like it goes together. Yes, yes, yes. Let's see. Mm -hmm. It goes together. So let's work on that layer. And now I can go like this. Oh, I need the pen first. Boom. And then go back and then erase. You see? Yes, 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 yes. Nice. It's got to have some patches. Got his patches. 
Let me see that. Okay, that's good. So let's do the patch right here. Hmm. Oh, so that's that line. Let me see this one. There's that line. Okay, let's go with that one. Yeah, you have to pay attention to your layers because it's really easy to get lost and do something you didn't want to do. And then you have to backtrack like, oh, man. And uh, it's, 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 it messes up your flow. Like you want to feel like you're moving through it. Uh, there we go. There it is. Boom. Now uh, another one. This one. Yep. Bam. And get erased. There it is. And there it comes. There it goes. Oh, my gosh. Yes. All right. I'm going to. Bam. Boom. Just making lines. I don't know if that's the same layer. Let's take a look. Oh, yes, it is. That's all good. I'll, I'll work with it. I'll work with it. Just roll with it doesn't have to be perfect and I don't want perfect um, I wanted to have that hand-drawn feel to it it's like yeah somebody drew this I did that DTM did that all right I don't like that line there it is so let's go like this let's go make it funky 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 Mm -hmm. I don't know what's going to go there, but something is could be there. Uh, I also like adding like uh, ports, kind of like the Matrix. You know, they had the ports on their uh, arms and so on. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that, that was cool. So uh, what's crazy is this guy I know, he, his, he goes by the name uh, uh, Matrix. That's him. That's his name, Matrix. And uh, that's what you call him. When you talk to him, you call him Matrix. And... Uh, and so I tattooed on him some ports, literally ports on his arm, on his back of his neck, uh, shoulders, everywhere there is a uh, matrix port. I may watch that movie tonight while I'm drawing um, the sketchy. And so, um, so yeah, so he's he has ports. And I like drawing that on, on some of my characters. I, I don't know what it means or what it's for, but I like it. Not sports, but, f but, uh, what did I say? Ports. There we go. Bam. So let's do one big one there, a bigger, bigger one, and a little one. Nice. Boom. And then, uh, uh huh. And then this one's kind of fat. There it is. And then this one, there it goes. And now we need some circles. So let's do that in a different layer so that way it's easier. And I think that's it. We're going to end it at this point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, thank you for hanging out with me today. Sorry I was talking bad about that guy from uh, Bill and Ted's. <laughs> um, he doesn't have to change. But it stayed in my mind. It's like, why? Why are we talking about somebody? Hey, look, now I can't draw because I was being bad. Mm-hmm. Let's go. Nope. Let's do it again. Do it again. Um, but, yes, uh, thank you for hanging out. Make sure you stop by tomorrow. Tomorrow, I'm going to be on Behance Live at 12.30 p.m. That is Eastern Standard Time if you're on the West Coast. Then that is uh, 9.30. Yeah, see y'all tomorrow. Have a good night. Good night, Golden Blizz. Um, but yes, uh, it's going to be bright and early on the West Coast. 9.30 a.m. is the middle of the day here uh, in Atlanta, Georgia. ATL, baby. I'm on the grind, baby. ATL, baby. Oh, there it is. Got it. Good. There's going to be some more details that I do here. How, I'm not sure, but I know I want more. I want more. And then, uh, so yeah, there's going to be a lot of drawings. Whew, three streams for you today. Thanks for all them all. Yes, Gareth. Whew, it feels like it was three. It was two this morning and right now. Uh, oh, but you, you were here last night. <laughs> that is three. Three and 24 hours. Correct. 
Wow. And I'm going to go live tomorrow evening for my subscribers. So check out my Behance subscription page. If you are interested in learning more about Adobe Illustrator and uh, vector brushes and uh, vector art, then get at me. Let's talk about it. I, I will talk about it all day. That's what I do. I'm an artist. I love to draw. Boom, boom, boom. Thanks, Odari. Thanks, Golden Rose. Thanks, Gareth. I appreciate all of you, Tamika, uh, Bree. I thought I saw Bree's name somewhere around here. And uh, thank you for stopping by. Thank you to everyone in the Discord right now hanging out. We have, um, let me see, we have uh, uh, Odari. Um, there it is. Uh, get that. Odari, Tamika, and uh, Bree here. Oh, uh, you know what? What happened? I don't know. Something crashed. You guys didn't say nothing. You guys could have said, Dan, the picture is gone. Anyways, <laughs> thank you all for being here. I appreciate it. And uh, keeping me honest and uh, staying, keeping it together. You know, let's let's draw together, hang out together, make art together. Thank you, Brie, says uh, great session. Yes, it's a short one. If you see how tired I am. Um, but we'll talk some more tomorrow. See you at 9.30 p.m. I mean, a.m. Pacific or 12.30 p.m. Eastern. Yes, it's uh, it's going to be another fun day. I have to think about what shirt I'm going to wear because um, I wore a regular blue shirt. I think I want a shirt with uh, some artwork in it. We'll see how it goes. Peace out, everybody. Mm -hmm.